So before I completely start off this video and talk about what's happening, I just want to say these are allegations. Don't go around saying these are true. Don't think that Pat here is a terrible person. Just these are allegations. We don't know if they're confirmed or not. There's a bunch of tweets and stuff that may suggest it, but we just don't know for sure. So don't take this as, oh, this is all true, because this is not all true. These are allegations. Now that's out of the way. Let's actually just hop into what's happening. I'm sure we all know who Popular MMOs is. Uh, he is, well, he was... One of the biggest Minecraft channels that, you know, was around during the big boom back in 2013-ish? Around the early 2010s. Uh, he was one of the biggest Minecraft YouTubers there, you know, with like Dan TDM and Stampy. Uh, as two other examples of that time period. Um, he, so, this guy, you know, he was big. Uh, and then Minecraft kind of died and now it's back, but, you know... He's, after it died, he still did good for himself, and I think we all know the whole thing where he unfortunately uh, got a divorce with his wife, uh, Jen, uh, who, you know, they did videos together a lot, and it was sad to hear this. But he ended up getting a new girlfriend, and that girlfriend has kind of fucked him around a bit, and that's what we're going to get into today. So, it all starts, this whole thing started when Pat here, or Popular MMO, so I'm just going to call him Pat for now, uh, posted a tweet saying, always good to say goodbye to the bad in your life and make upgrades moving forward. So, this is obviously hinting to the whole fucking, uh, the, well no, this isn't hinting to the whole fucking thing, this is hinting towards something bad must have happened, and now he's moving forward with it. I'm not sure. Uh, a lot of people were kind of confused about this. However, this confusion didn't last long because Pat ended up posting a tweet three days later, um, pretty much saying this. Don't believe everything you hear. I will need to address the false accusations soon. And Eleni, thanks for leaking my address and harassing me. And Liz, when she told you to stop posting about her and you refused, you are a terrible person. Okay, the last tweet was too much. Now, this is the current version of the tweet. And I'm saying current because, you know, he has that final line saying, okay, the last tweet was way too much. This is hinting towards how he actually posted this tweet earlier, but with Eleni's, uh address included. So he was kind of doing a thing where, how dare you dox me, I'm going to dox you. And that's not going to help at all. You know, I remember being in fucking kindergarten, fucking school, whatever. And just like, you know, thinking that if if they do bad to me, I can do it back. But that's not how it works. Uh, like, when you're actually like an adult. It's not how it works at all. And so... Of course, he saw how fucked up it was, and he ended up, you know, changing back and just saying, like, just removing that tweet and reposting it, but without the fucking address. Of course, it doesn't excuse, you know, doxing her in the first place, but that's what he did, and he did try to redeem himself in some way. Now, during this little period... Gaming with Jen, uh, his ex-wife, actually went on and uh, liked a tweet saying Pat abuses women. Uh, a lot of people were like, oh shit, okay. And this is where the main allegations come from. These accusations are about domestic violence because this all kind of started when a police report came out uh, pretty much having domestic violence and shit like that. But back to the main thing where Jen liked this tweet. A lot of people were like, oh shit, does he actually abuse women? And Jen ended up coming out uh, with a tweet saying, I do not use Twitter regularly. 
But when I messaged about all this drama, I went on to see what was being said. By accident, I liked a tweet that is now being seen in a poor manner. Pat never, in the 10 years we were together, laid a hand on me. That was the tweet brought out, and all people are oh, okay. Right. I see. Okay. And so far, the situation has evolved into... You know, two other tweets saying, I see Eleni changed her profile picture on YouTube to a mugshot. Guess she is ready, getting ready early for all the slander and defamation of character. Since Eleni leaked my address, someone tried to put my house illegally on the market to sell it. Thanks, Eleni. You are a great person. It's not really going to work out for Pat, I don't think, because mainly he did attempt to dox uh, Eleni in the first place. Uh, but... What do I think? I think it's sad to hear that shit is coming out about a well-known Minecraft YouTuber I did respect. Of course, these are accusations. I'm not going to take this as full on. But because this all happening is pretty sad. And, you know, it's looking kind of sad. But what do you guys think? I think that's it for this video. See you guys later. Goodbye.